Welcome or welcome back to the Bauer Beauty Experience. My name is Jenny Bauer and I'm an esthetician and the founder of Bauer Beauty Skincare. You can find the links to our products in the description. We design anti-aging skincare for sensitive skin. If that's you, if that's you, check out the products in the description. On this channel, we talk about holistic beauty, mind, body, spirit, and basically just, you know, anything in that realm. So subscribe, join the fam. So today I'm doing Amazon faves. Have I ever done Amazon faves? Someone please tell me, cause I feel like I never have and I feel like I've thought about it or tried or can't believe that this has never occurred before. Vlogmas day, whatever it is, and exciting news, I got a bunch of decorations that are coming, so my background will be more Christmassy, and my whole vibe will be a little more Christmassy, which will be exciting. Let's jump into Amazon faves. I love watching these videos, so I really was excited to make this video for you guys. It's going to be kind of in a little bit of a random Order. I'm just gonna pick up things as I see them and show them to you. Also, there are a few things that I wanna tell you about that I actually do not have present because they're in my storage unit, but they're more wintry items that I would recommend for you. Let's just start with the thing closest to me. This is an Anne Klein bag that I got from Amazon and I just absolutely love it. I think it looks so classy. It's just such a beautiful color. It feels very equestrian to me. It looks so classy with like the saddle tan, and I think it was like $60. The saddle tan and the gold trim. And I love that it has the handles as well as the strap. This bag was like an immediate yes for me because I just felt like it was so, when I bought it this summer, it was so Hamptons. It was so, so classy and upscale feeling. And that's the vibe I get when I wear this. It just feels nice. It feels upscale. And I just think it's gorgeous and unique. Next, in the way of purses, this is an Aldo, a cream Aldo bag with gold hardware. Again, with it's the strap or the other strap so you can wear it crossbody or however you want and i think it just looks really nice if you look up close it says aldo which i definitely don't like but i don't think most people notice that but it's just a nice like casual inexpensive bag i love this cream color it's a little bit of like a pink undertony beige, so I just think it's absolutely stunning and I get compliments on it all the time. Next is something I personally use as a beach bag or a yoga bag. This is a tote that is woven with whatever this, call, this is called, and it's just very easy for me to just throw things in here, take them to the beach, and it's not too expensive, so you don't have to worry about like taking it to the beach and messing it up or taking it to the pool and messing it up. I love how long the straps are. It just makes it really easy to throw over your shoulder and I think it's like a complimentary neutral color it, it looks good it's kind of like understated okay next is this large crystal vase that I use for roses for long stem roses so in the past every time I buy roses I usually put them in a vase that's like what is it vase vase I, I don't know it depends on my mood I say both so I usually put them in a vase that's like this short and I'll cut the roses that short. I kind of got into the aesthetic of leaving the full stem of the rose and leaving the leaves on and all and just leaving them in their natural state with this clear vase like long stem roses in here leaving them at their full length their full length of their full stem it just looked stunning i love keeping this on the center of my kitchen table sometimes i keep them on my coffee table right here it just depends okay next is is a battery basically a massive battery it's a portable generator and i got this you know for hurricane season or whatever in case your electricity goes out there's like usb ports there's like a is that a 12 volt i don't know what that is but anyways you can charge your phone and there's also a flashlight here Whew. so actually i never had I never had to use this, but I think that's, it's such an amazing thing to have if you live in a state or at anyone basically that you could potentially lose power, you want this. You really do. You wanna be prepared. Next, sorry if I have summery clothes. I do have some summery clothes I'll be showing you, but I will be showing you winter clothes as well. This is like a fun little skirt that I wear like high-waisted 
here and it's just so easy. It's so easy and it's so comfortable when it's hot out or if you're like on vacation somewhere, if you want to wear this over a bathing suit or if you just want to like wake up and throw this on and throw a tank top on and it's cute, but it's easy, but it's cute and it's effortless. Feel me? Yeah, I feel like these skirts, these types of skirts are mandatory. Next is something I got completely addicted to and bought in every single color. These are tennis skirts. Tennis skirts, they have skirts and then shorts underneath. I got them for, originally I got them for golfing, but then like, I literally wear them. I used to wear them every day here, but oh my God, these are so fantastic. First of all, they are so flattering because I look good in very short, shorts and short skirts because of the shape of my legs but i don't want my butt hanging out so the fact that this has shorts underneath is just so amazing so they are very flattering when you wear them they're the perfect blend of form and function that is the ideal like everyday capsule wardrobe for me something that is functional but attractive and kind of looks like you try you know comfortable without being like sweatpants every day and that is what i use tennis skirts for have these in every color black white navy i've got this pink one too which is actually a different brand i still got it from amazon this the only thing with this is this is a lot shorter than these ones so it's like a little less comfortable and i probably wouldn't golf in this i also like that these ones have the zippers back here so i just put my id or my keys or my lip gloss back there oh and they also have pockets in the shorts do you know what i mean it's the most amazing piece of wardrobe that I purchased in, in the spring. I was so flabbergasted, like why didn't I start wearing tennis skirts earlier? Like you look so bougie and cute and it's effortless and it's easy. And so if it's hot out, you're not like worried about like sweating up your whole outfit because it's that material that's like jersey, so it's athletic and it's just amazing. I am so obsessed with these tennis skirts, holy crap. Another obsession of mine that I wear almost every day of my life are these tank tops. These, I think they're called bralettes on Amazon, but this is my workout uniform. This is what I wear. I wear this and these shorts. Like these shorts, I, I don't know what I would do without them. I wear this more than anything in the world because I wear them every morning. Every morning I wear these black shorts. I have them in gray too. I have two pairs of black and one pair of gray, but they are the perfect like type of fabric that really snatches you up top and i just obviously the pockets are so key and they're the perfect length they're not too short as you can see but they are not long long they're very flattering very cute but you can work out and not feel like your butt's hanging out and then this tank top is just the most amazing thing in the universe like i think that i i wear these like even in the winter time when i lived up north and it was winter time i would still wear this to the gym and i would just wear a sweatshirt over it going into the gym so it's like i still wear these every day no matter the season they are so flattering you do not need a sports bra i don't know what we were thinking like back in the day when we were a sports bra and a tank top over it no 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 no, no. it's all about the built-in bra honey it's very flattering, it's very comfortable, and it's very easy. And I also use these even if I don't work out in them. I like using them for like uh, wearing on a daily basis. Like I'll definitely wear this with a tennis skirt all day. All day, honey. You know what I mean? So yes, then the shorts were the next thing, which they are amazing. Another pair of shorts. These shorts I pretty much wear all the time. They're kind of like the sweatpant of shorts, if you will. They're just like, I wanted a short that wasn't tight. All my shorts were like this tight at some point so when I moved down here I like was like well I need shorts for like every day just taking puffy for a walk or going to get the mail I don't want my butt to be hanging out so that's the purpose these serve and I have them in two colors I have this color and then I have peach but they are so damn flattering and comfortable oh my god they hit you perfectly at the waist and they flare out a little bit and of course they have pockets and they are long enough they are long enough to cover your whole booty so that's really what makes them very comfortable and flattering and easy they're amazing, literally amazing. Next, I have a ton of these robes. I, not just, not this style, because it only came in one color, but I have a ton of silk ro robes because I just love lounging around the house in them or out of the shower putting them on. But this one is one of my favorites for multiple reasons, which is why I have dozens of robes, but this is like one of three that I bought, brought to Miami with me. So I love the color, first of all. This is like a seafoam green, kind of, but the best part about this is this string is attached. I lose my damn strings regularly. This one, I just, 
love that I never need to be stressed about where it is because it's always attached. It's also a really nice length. It's like T length, you know, it's not short. It goes down to like your mid, like past your knee, like your mid shin. And it's so flattering and classy. If you don't have satin robes, silk robes, I highly recommend getting some. This one I just absolutely love. Okay, next. Oh my God, these are incredible. I just don't even know what I did before I had a clothing article like this. This is a white linen shirt and it has like a split right here. It's so sexy if you wear it over a bathing suit. Oh my gosh. But if you wear it on its own, it's super hot too. For example, let's say I was just going to lunch right now. Obviously I don't want a leather jacket or a denim jacket or, you know, what am I going to wear over this? This is what I'm going to wear over this, honey, this. Okay. Like it's the most versatile and it elevates your look. It elevates the, how you look in your style. Like because of the split, you can also tie it if you want. You know what I mean? So you can leave it open or tie it, but also it functions like as a bathing suit cover up too. So it's truly incredible. Actually, I wore this to go out at night once too with white pants and a white bra and I just tied this up front and I wore a white bra, white pants, gold jewelry. It was incredible and stunning. I highly recommend this. I loved it so much that I bought it in another color, which I'm going to show you. So I bought this in blue as well. They have a bunch of different colors, but the blue one has this detail on it if you can see it has the detail on it but it's the same exact cut where it's split here and blue is just a very complimentary kind of preppy looking color that i just absolutely love this is one of the most amazing things that i have ever purchased it's a hat for high ponytails i barely ever wear a low ponytail right but when i go outside i want to grab a hat and it's so annoying to redo my ponytail if i have a high ponytail just to fit it into a hat and then it's like the hat fits weird and you have like a low hanging ponytail and it's not as attractive like when you have a high ponytail hat hunty like it's just so much cuter I'm not gonna put the damn hat on but basically you know you can see the ponytail and it's it's the best thing ever because it's like cut out it's technically for girls that have a lot of big curly hair to be able to wear a hat but like for me I use it as a high ponytail hat and it's been a game changer oh my gosh such a game changer it's so easy to just throw on and it looks way cuter next is this set. I wear this either as a workout set or just like an everyday type of running around set. The shorts are kind of, you know, like they're high-waisted and they're long enough. And then the top is like, it just is flattering. It's a flattering color. It's a flattering cut. The fabric is nice. It kind of holds you in really well. The only thing I'll say is it kind of shows your panties sometimes, which is annoying. However, I just make it work. I just wear seamless panties or something like that but I love this. I have this in blue and green and I wear it quite frequently around or to the gym. I like versatile items. By the way, I'm doing no skincare in this video. I will do Amazon skincare in another video just because it needs its own video. There's just so much. Next is this Thai crystal deodorant. Have you ever used this? Because if not, I highly recommend it. It is like the best by far natural deodorant that I've ever used. And it's just potassium sorbate salt. So you get it wet. I leave my skin wet and I just put it on after the shower and it's incredible for two reasons one it does help to kill any bacteria if you you know have shaved and so i love that it prevents razor bumps or whatever but also it just like is completely magic it, it works as an antiperspirant but the thing is is i actually layer another antiperspirant it's warm here so i need a second deodorant but i still love this and in the winter time when i lived up north in the winter like i would absolutely never have to wear anything else but it's warm here so just in case i always layer another deodorant on top. However, this is the best natural one that I've ever used. Next is a, um, a home item, a decor item. I love the fashion books and I have like a lot of spaces, like see this small space under my, by the way, look at my ambiance. It's an adorable scene of a porch with a fire and a snowfall. So cute. So yeah, I have these small spaces that I didn't know what to do with. I have the coffee table with the same small space. Like, what are you going to do? You can't put a candle down there. What are you really going to put down there? So I decided to invest in one of these fashion books and 
And I'll probably buy more, but I just loved this Dior one because I feel like everyone has the Chanel one, which I'll probably buy as well. But this Dior one was just very classy and neutral, monochromatic. It kind of meshed with the look of this area. I have like a white pumpkin over there too. It's obviously not too crazy. Minimalism. But yeah, so I love this and it's actually very good quality and it's very heavy and it has actual, you know, pages in here. Some of these books, they're literally just to the outside and the inside is like fake pages or blank pages because it's just for decor, but this is actually readable. That's pretty amazing. Let's do jewelry since that's its whole category. Uh, I get a lot of jewelry from Amazon. I like jewelry that I can wear full time. I do not want jewelry that's turning green after a day or two. I want stuff that's like decent quality that is durable. I wear my rings full time. I put lotion on. I just, I wore my ankle bracelet for months. Like I do not take that thing off. So this jewelry is pretty durable, even though it is from Amazon. The first is this ring right here. I love it because I wear it every day and I never get sick of it. It has a classic feel to it. I wear this so much and it gets oils on it and lotions and perfumes, you name it. Everything they tell you not to do, I do with jewelry. I wash my hands with it, it sits in water. Like I care 0% about micromanaging my jewelry at this point in my life. Point is it's durable. So this ring from Amazon, I absolutely love. As you can see, maybe it has turned maybe it's turned a little bit I can't even tell but I have never seen it turn me any type of weird colors and it's just it's very durable I've had it for I don't know how long okay next these gold earrings that I think every girl has I went to a med spa the other day I'm like are those the gold earrings from Amazon they're just so amazing they're amazing for every day obviously wear them every day but they're like a little bit bigger than the huggies which these are also from Amazon you've got the huggies the ones I have came in a set of two these are the other ones so sometimes I wear two huggies and sometimes I wear this and one huggy. This huggy is encrusted with rhinestones and then these ones are just plain gold plated. Now I have these hoops as well. I love how skinny they are and they are rhinestone and gold. I would say these are probably turning a little bit, but I just don't care that much. You can't really tell. And when I wear them, they just look so sparkly and they hit. And one of you guys asked me that I wear your hoops from and I'm like, I have no idea. And then I went to create this video and I saw them in my Amazon purchase and I'm like, duh, everything I buy is from Amazon. So that makes sense. This is the ankle bracelet that's probably my favorite that I've worn the most. It's a gold chain. You have to be really careful though because like they can snap off. You know, this type of jewelry, the ankle bracelets and some of the other jewelry that I'm gonna show you, they can snap snap off. The set I got came in a set of three. I honestly like all of them, but this one's definitely my favorite. Next are belly chains, which are hella, hella temperamental, bitch. Okay, I have broken every single one of these belly chains. They are so, look at how delicate they are, right? They're stunning and they are delicate and gorgeous. And basically, you know, when you're standing up, your waist is smaller than when you're sitting down. So when I'm standing up in the mirror and I'm looking, I'm like, oh, this looks great. It looks perfect. But then you put it to the sides, but then when you sit down and your waist expands, it snaps. Like it's done that now so many times. So you have to be really careful with these. And of course you can leave the links back together. Honestly, belly chains are it. How cute is this? But the, yeah, the links are so skinny that they're prone to breaking, but I, I highly love those. I love them. They're just like the perfect detail. Moving on to this devicey right here. If you get pinched nerves ever, oh my God, this thing is the best thing ever. It is so amazing. As you can see, it hooks to the back so you can really get precisely what you need, where you need, whatever. And it has this little ball on the end, but also these, if you just want to do your neck, you can do it that way like there's just endless things you can like stretch in certain ways like there's just endless things you can do with this little thing this little device and I just absolutely love it actually I had to reorder it because I left mine in Michigan so I ordered a second one it's okay I'm gonna have two houses so I'll keep one in each house Okay, next is my protein powder. I get this protein powder probably once every two weeks. It is very high quality. It is not too expensive. I think I paid 27 or 28 for this. What I like most about it is that it does not contain stevia because stevia is in everything and stevia messes up my stomach and digestion. So I cannot ingest stevia in large quantities. So this has monk fruit and cane sugar. We demonize sugar. No, just put a little sugar in it. Skip the stevia, put some sugar in it. And the ingredients are pretty limited. 
as you can see. Also, in addition to pea protein, it has kale, barley grass, wheatgrass, alfalfa grass, quinoa, and that's basically it, and a few sweeteners. I just love this. I love that it's minimal. I love that it doesn't have stevia. It tastes fine. It's USD organic, etc., etc. So this is the protein powder I buy every other week on Amazon. Next, if you don't have one of these, I just, I implore you to reconsider your existence. This is a mini frother. You need a whisk. You don't even understand. This is my, probably my most used kitchen supply. It's really like for whisking eggs or for whisking your coffee. Every day I whisk my coffee or my matcha or whatever. Like you don't even understand. It frothes everything up. It makes everything perfectly blended. It makes everything more exciting. It's just the most common sense thing. It's like a no brainer. You just need one. Okay. It makes your life way easier and way better. It's the gift that keeps on giving. Next is a basic black fanny pack. I've never worn a fanny pack other than maybe like in elementary school or something. But when I moved here, just want something for on the go. I'm just running around, running here, running there. I don't want to have a purse. So this goes around my hips and is very cute and very useful and even flattering, I might say. It looks just so complimentary, like an accessory almost. It's just really nice and useful. Next are these cute ass clips, these hair clips. They just look so cute. You can do anything. You can look really cute. Obviously, I wouldn't wear it like this, but it makes you look like you tried even when you didn't try. And they're just so classy and flattering, and I love them so much. And the one I tagged, the one I have, comes in a pack of four. This one I clearly have not used. This is one I broke the other one. I broke a fourth one. This is one, the one I broke was really cute. It's probably my favorite, which is why it's broken. I wore it every day. These are so adorable and it's pretty because they're clear. So all you can see is the outline of the pearls in your hair and it's just so gorgeous. All righty, a few more things left. First are these non-crease hair clips. So basically when you sometimes finish your hair before your makeup, you can do this and hold your pieces back without creasing them. You can also help use these to help set your bangs in place. Let's say you want your bangs to be more curtainy. You can swirl it up and clip it and let it set into place. And it's just, they're very useful. So sometimes I also use these when I have rollers in. One of the best hair tools I've ever purchased is this right here. This hair tool right here. Holy cannoli. Holy cannoli. Um, talk about an easy, effortless, hot way to wear your hair. This is so easy peasy. I mean, it gets so hot and then you just clamp, 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 clamp clamp all over your hair it's the most effortless hairstyle that I do and I love the volume it gives also sometimes after I'm done crimping I spray with salt water and scrunch and it's so freaking fabulous okay last but not least is the most fun thing in the universe and this is a pet camera a pet monitor so I have a nanny that comes to get puffy when I go out of town and she brings him home at home at night so he gets to stay in our house when I go out of town and it's the best thing ever but I love to spy on him and I bought this and I just log on from my phone and I can see him what he's doing and I this also spins and he is freaking scared of this thing which is so cute which is why I can't spin it if he's sleeping because his little face he will wake up he will be so suspicious he will leave the room and then I won't be able to spy on him and I love this thing and I think it was pretty reasonably priced and it works really well but a few more things that are not present this dress right here this is a sweater dress that I bought from Amazon last year I will insert a photo so you can see me wearing it but this is the most beautiful steel green color. It's a great length because it's not too short, but it's short enough and it's very flattering. You can wear it with black high over the knee boots or, you know, saddle tan over the knee boots. I've done all of the above, but it is just such a stunning cut and fabric and I have it in black as well and both are amazing. This dress I also really enjoyed. It's a very baggy green oversized sweater dress. It was very easy and kind of cute and trendy because it's like that oversized. And so it's very comfortable too because it's loose and it's big and you can just easily for like a Sunday brunch, just throw that on with some over the knee boots and a jacket and you're good to go. Okay, now I must show you something. The last thing in the kitchen. This is my air fryer and it's pretty much the most amazing thing I have ever purchased. And what I do is I just put aluminum foil in here and so this barely gets dirty and it truly cooks food more deliciously and faster and easier than I have ever experienced in my entire existence. The hype with air fryers is 
no joke. This is an incredible tool. I don't even get it. Like before the air fryer, my chicken was disgusting and boring. You can put anything in there and it comes out crispy on the outside, moist on the inside, and it's done in like 12 minutes. It is truly the best thing ever. Swear on it. I swear on my air fryer. I don't know what that meant, but I hope you guys enjoyed my Amazon favorites and I will see you in the next video.